What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Taj, and I am back with another video. This is sort of a morning routine. Not really my morning routine, but this is a routine that I do on the weekend when my oldest children are not with me, and it's just me and Cadence. Now, in this video, my children are here, but I wanted to film this video on the weekend, so I told them to just stay out of the camera. They had already ate breakfast and did what they had to do in the living room and kitchen area and that's when I started recording because you will see that it is late in the well it's not late but it's around 12 o'clock in this video um, on the weekends I do wake up late me and Cadence to get up around 11 30 we just lay around in the bed when I do get up this is my actual routine so I get up I straighten my bed she's usually still sleeping laying around watching TV advantage of this time to read my books listen to my music I do take my stress relief gummies um these are something new that I'm trying I don't really see a difference with these so I wouldn't recommend them but after I get myself together in the mornings and I think that's very important people I do go ahead and um, drink my tea now, I didn't show you guys my um, how I make my tea, but I do use a supplement in there for my anxiety as well because I do have terrible anxiety. Um, it's called Natural Calm. I do use that every single morning and some nights too if my anxiety is like through the roof. But I do use that every single morning when I drink my tea. That is what's always going to be in my tea. Um, and I usually do skip breakfast. I know it's not a good habit, but I try to eat breakfast if I feel just a little bit hungry. But usually I do skip it. And while I'm drinking my tea, I just fix her something to eat and we have our morning time. And right after, I just get into my cleaning routine because I do like to keep a clean house. Now, saying that it is important for me personally to clean up every day I do have four children that reside with me in this house and they are messy okay every day all day Now this video, um, this part of it is going to be cut short. Hey, K-Book! <laughs> it is going to be cut short because I did have an unexpected guest come to my house. So I had to start recording this day. But I am going to pick it up where I left off um, in a few seconds here. And this is the next day. Um, I just um, straighten up in the kitchen again every day, like I said, every day. And ignored that on my face. Um, my kids are going to be in this part of it. But yeah, me and my daughter are treating our pimples. So just ignore <laughs> that. <laughs> I am such a clown. But yeah, I needed some more honey. That was nasty. But yes, I'm just having my tea time and a little cadence time while I'm cleaning up. I'm just, you know, checking to see if it's cooled down and cleaning up. And that's usually how my Saturdays go, especially if we have somewhere to go. I'm trying to do everything at once. So yeah, I'm multitasking. And you know, I had to turn on my jams to clean up. You cannot clean in silence. Okay, maybe you can, but I cannot clean in silence. I can't do anything in silence. And did y'all see the pile of trash? Y'all just saw me sweep this exact floor the day before, right? When I say I have to clean up every day, I mean that thing, y'all. <laughs> 
But yes, here I am in Bryson's room and you are going to see me fussing like throughout this entire segment of cleaning the kids' rooms because this is their chore. They literally know that they are to clean their rooms every day or straighten it up every day, you know, put things back in its place. And throughout this whole time, I'm looking all around this room like there is nothing in place, sir. How did this get out of place? Where does this go? Why do you have this here? So, yeah. And I don't have any shame in being a mom, okay? <laughs> Yes, I am fussing about this room because we constantly get into it about this room. Uh, not you standing up on the bed because you forgot I was recording. Yeah, I'm gonna leave that in there so he can see it. <laughs> and here I'm fussing about him writing on his sheets. I don't know what it is about this child, but he will literally write a whole essay on his bed sheets. Do not ask me why. That's that we <laughs> listen. <laughs> Comment down below if you have a child that loves to write on themselves, on books, on book bags, on bed linens. Yeah, this child right here, this child right here, boy. <laughs> And of course, this would not be a true mom style clean with me without a toddler running in, right? So here she comes. She messing up the bed we just made. <laughs> and I'm just gonna guess that he forgot he was being recorded again because <laughs> why are you throwing stuff at my baby? Mm -hmm. Bryson, sit down. I am about to mop the entire house, but I did not get footage of that. You're just gonna see me mopping his floor. But this squirt and mop is by Method. It's um, for wood floors. I would not recommend, that's why I did not show you guys, but it does smell good, but that's about it. It gets about two stars from me. I do have my daughter here cleaning their bathroom for the week. I do not clean their bathroom. I just do the weekly wipe downs um, because I let them know if you make the mess, you're gonna clean it up. I mean, we just gonna keep it real on this channel, okay? All right, they take turns cleaning the bathroom. I just make sure it's disinfected. Wipe down really good and I do my inspection and they are done. I'm so proud of her. Like her shoes are always just thrown around. She don't never know where her mates are. They were all put together. Yay, Zariana. <laughs> After I am done cleaning up the entire house, I do like to light my candles everywhere, spray my room sprays, um, put in my plug-ins if I have some to change that weekend. Just get the house smelling good, and that's what I'm doing here. And all mamas of toddlers, I am here with you, girl. Do you hear me? I am here with you. We just got through cleaning up, and as I am spraying, Cadence is taking out her toys and dumping them all over the place. But have no fear. She's going to clean these up before we dot that door. He's in here messing it up. So, yeah. Mamas, I feel you. I do understand. As soon as you clean up, they mess up. But guess what? We're going to be cleaning up again tomorrow. No, we not. Oh, yes, we are. This is an everyday thing in my house. They have to go to bed with a clean room, and they have to wake up and straighten their beds and make sure everything is put away. Okay? That's his school stuff. And I check closets. I check floors. I check under beds every day. That is a commitment that I made because I'm tired of these rooms, their rooms, looking such a mess. So, yeah. And if y'all are wondering about this thing on his head, I know he has it on in like almost every video. He's a young man. He's trying to keep his waves. That is a wave cap. 
So anytime y'all see Bryson, he's gonna have that on his head because he literally comes home from school and slaps that thing on his head. He wears he wears it all day, every day, okay? So yes, it's dingy. <laughs> supposed to be yellow and it turn another color but that's his thing his waves are popping though so we not we not hate they popping i'm about to remodel this entire bathroom but i gotta refill this basket with some tissue kids as y'all know are destructive as hell you see this right here they did that that was not like that when we moved here so i wanted to put decorative towels there but i am so scared and that little nail right there when they first start tearing it up, I caught myself trying to fix it. They came back in and made it come from up under the nails. So yeah, they're destructive. Mm. Mostly my son, um, but I'm about to try to do a little decoration in here, change out the shower curtain, put a rug in here. See, can I get somebody to come in and fix this? Cause yeah. Put some pictures up finally. I am so scared, but I'm gonna have to threaten them. That's why I really don't show y'all this side of the house, because it's very naked. Because this is the kids' side of the house. There's nothing over here to look at. All right. This is the kitchen. I got this little diffuser from Target. And the $5 section, it works. It's, it's okay, but I just bought it because it was cute. But that is a Bath and Body Works that needs to be refilled. Um, I'm probably gonna get a copyright claim because of that music. But the kitchen, the dishwasher was full. So my daughter went ahead and finished these. And like I said, I've been in here washing on and off the entire time I've been cleaning. So this is like our third load that we're washing. We got some in the dryer over here. This is the detergent I use. I don't know if you can hear me over the wash and dryer, but this is the detergent I use. I usually switch up my scents. I switch up fabric softener scents, dishwashing liquid, uh, cleaning products. I am a sucker for scents, but this one I have been using for about three months. Um, I'm probably gonna get another scent when I go back, but I just bought this. Um, and this is... And this is the Fresh Burst. It smells really, really good. It gets the job done. And these smell so divine. Oh my God, oh my God. And I buy such a huge box, y'all, because listen, I don't know how y'all do in y'all house, but when I am drying clothes, I like to season them. I put like four or five in my dryer. Y'all don't judge me. Don't judge me, okay? I like my clothes to smell like they're clean, you know? <laughs> but yeah, this is what I am fixing to do and I'm about to get dressed while these are washing. This is Kayla. Hey, hey, y'all, I got me a new face. So we are about to go to the park and have a little fun today. I wanna to thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks so much for watching if this is your first time. Thank you for clicking on my video and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.